All right, folks. Asteroid Belt, take two from well, take two from yesterday, I should say. Let's do this and get your. There we go. Ha <laughs> ha. Always forget to put the focus back on the screen after I uh, hit the record button. Nah. <laughs> All right, I'm armed with double blasters, better reflexes. Let's do this. What's really odd is I did a practice run uh, last night just to see if I could do this stage, and I actually did pretty well. I beat it on the first try. I had a close call in the end, but no deaths. So that was very nice. Let's see if I can do a repeat performance today and not screw up horribly. Whoa. Uh. I need to get this out of the way right now. There are more than likely not be a video up tomorrow. Uh, the reason being, I am going to be... I have to be at work by 10.30. And we're doing a uh, big... We're basically setting up a small little stand in the local school for like a booster club event or something like that. We're selling them sandwiches so they can sell sandwiches to, uh, to the crowd. Uh, you know, basically, you know, everyone pays, everyone works out, they make a buck for every sandwich they sell, and, yeah, and we get a lot of sandwich sales. We're going to be doing that for a good, uh, probably till 7 or 8 o'clock. So I will more than likely not be able to get a video up tomorrow because of that. No, I want the blasters. Yes! All right, this will make things so much easier against the boss. And I've also figured out that the reason why I had that spray of lasers coming at me the only time you saw me get to the boss is because, well, I was firing at the spread. Or I was firing at the boss when he was spinning his little things. So, yeah. <laughs> See, so, yeah, I'll do this here. Do. Come on, destroy him, because I don't want a constant laser spread going at me. Oh. Oh, health. Bogey on your six. I'm on it, Falco. What the, screw you two. I say that every single time. I need to learn new things to say. Oh, he's getting the one-up for me. Oh, that was super nice of him, though. I never noticed that before. He actually was helping me get that one-up, which is cool. I guess that's the reward I get for helping him out. And look out. As soon as you blast the enemy, the asteroid is going to come barreling at you. Or going barreling at where you last were. So, be careful. Alright, well, take him out. Take him out, Peppy. Take him out. Come on. Take him out, then be all your boastful that you did it! Ah! Holy cow. And that's why I'm not able to make videos at night. Uh, there are other people in this house, and I don't want to wake them up with my girly screams while playing this game. Holy cow, look out for face. All right, all right. We're in very good shape. Let's see if we can do this again. Hate that enemy. Okay. A couple things to look out for. Missiles, and do not shoot the body. Whatever you do, do not shoot the body. All right, I'm going to get hit by, hit by this on purpose. There's the tracker beam they're telling you about. If that catches you, just rapidly do barrel rolls. Rapidly do barrel rolls, or it'll suck you into that spinning blades of death. Whoa, look out. Dang it. Look out for missiles. If you do not look out for missiles, you are going to die. Now, it's possible to avoid the tractor beam altogether, like so. And if you do that, then you don't have to worry about the whoa. Yeah, you don't have to worry about the whoa. Yeah, that's because that's a horrible thing to get caught in. Whoa. <laughs> that one wasn't even on purpose. That just kind of came out. Ah! Don't just... Focus on destroying the enemies, son. You can do this. Look out for tractor beam. I'm gonna go quiet here for a few, just because I kinda need to concentrate to get this guy down. Here. Barrel roll! Destroy this thing right here, as well as the missile. Alright. Alright, just two more to go. We got this. Well, we may have it. Last time I... Last time I said that, it didn't go so well. Shoot, the first time I learned that that was a curse was uh, I was in a raid on World of Warcraft back when level 70 was the cap. 
And uh, when I said that, that's when our all of our DPS died and all we had left was a tank and seven healers. And the boss enraged and killed everyone. So I need to not say that. But fortunately, the curse didn't come true today. And we beat him on the first shot. Booyah! Woo! That was close. Uh, that was intense, but uh, definitely much better than yesterday. I don't know what was wrong yesterday. I had to just dodge a lot of crap, I guess. And only 88%. Meh. Well, at least I got 92% on the uh, last stage, which was awesome. And we get to continue, which means we have a better chance of surviving. Now, one thing you may have already noticed is that there's one extra stage on level 3, so more opportunity for points and more opportunities for death. But without further ado, uh, there we go. I'll take care of that before I forget. <laughs> Let's head to Fortuna. Oh, shnikes. If this doesn't come out well, I'm going to have to go through Venom or Corneria level 3 again. Dang it! Should have switched states. Oh, well. There's creatures who live on Fortuna. Take care, Fox. All right. So this stage is... I've only made about halfway through this stage. I don't know what the boss looks like. But there are... Uh, it's actually kind of neat. I mean, you have a lot of flowers growing here, and that's kind of a neat little effect. I like that. I like this stage already. Uh, you have a bunch of little wasp or bee things here. I don't know if... Well, apparently you can just fly out and destroy them. You have dragonfly monsters here that you probably need to destroy. And Falco, for some reason, has an enemy ship on his tail, even though this is a planet habitated by wildlife. Andros has the wildlife under his control. Why does he need enemy ships? The wildlife looks pretty intimidating as it is. Ow. Shoot the dragonflies. Pretty sure they'll do something bad if you don't. And avoid the flowers. Flowers are bad. Okay. Whoa! I, what did I just say? Avoid the flippin' flowers. Oh, now they're coming out of nowhere. Whew. Oh, now they're trying to form arcs, eh? Whew, safe point. All right, I can dig this. Come on. If you know what that's from, you get points, but I doubt anyone, any of my viewers does because it wasn't very popular. And that plus I don't know the lyrics, and all you have to go by is my D's and do's. Are these guys harmful? Huh. Oh, crap. These guys. I think these guys caused me a lot of grief last time. Just because I was being stupid. Yes! I don't know if I'll need it, but I definitely want it. Yeah, look out for fire breath. Ow. Okay, that actually took off quite a bit of health. Holy cow. I just, just stop, stop. Just stop spazzing out and do this like a, do this calmly and collectively. And shoot the third one. All right. Because you cannot reflect fire. You only, you can only dodge the fire. Kind of a nice little relaxing stage here. I mean, the music is kind of calming, and you see a lot of wildlife. It's kind of nice. I like it. I like this stage. See, I'm trying to remember if there's a Fortuna in Star Fox 64. The second save point? That's not foreboding at all. Or a checkpoint, not save point. Uh, this stage must be pretty long. Holy cow, and we have lots of enemies firing at me, and I don't like it. I have to avoid flowers and enemies. Woo! -hoo! I don't like how this is placed, but oh, nope, I couldn't grab it. Let's see now. Where is the boss? I haven't even seen the boss of the stage, so this will be a learning experience. Whoa! -ho! Oh, oh, music's going quiet. What the heck is that? It's like a... That looks like a... The duo from Pokemon. 
No, it, no, but no, it's like a giant bird or something. What is this thing? How do I hurt it? Do I have to shoot in the tail? Apparently. Shoot in the tail and get the head to turn around here and... Yeah, shoot it in the eyeballs. That's, that's great. And shoot in the tail! What? <laughs> I thought I was gonna fly into it! What? I don't understand! What's going on here? This is weird! I'm hurting it, whatever I'm doing, and that doesn't look healthy. Oh, whatever it is, I think it's close to death, however I was hurting it, but... I lost a wing? Are you serious? Well, it's dead. I don't like having no wing, but it's dead. That was completely unexpected, getting through Fortuna on my first try? Huh! Guess this age isn't that bad at all. I still have no idea what I was doing against that boss. Ah, whatever. Well, that was a pleasant surprise for today. I was expecting to fail, big time. Nice. Only 69%, but I could only even know half of what I could destroy in that stage. Oh, let's do a save point here. And thank you for watching Let's Play Star Fox, everyone. And I shall see you all tomorrow. Well, no, not tomorrow. Well, maybe. Depends on if I can get a video or not out after I get off work. But don't count on it, viewers. Don't count on it. Anyways, thank you for watching again. And I need to stop repeating myself. Laters.